Hey friends, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. My name is Julie. I'm a mom to five and usually I share a lot of large family life, homeschooling, food videos. Uh, I don't usually post videos just showing outfits for myself, but I have bought a few new things for myself for this spring and summer and so I'm going to show you what I've bought. I may even do a try on and you'll see some of these items on me. If you're hearing noise in the background, it is so windy and we have a fireplace I'm sitting in our master bedroom and we have a fireplace in here. Oh, it's so loud. And because of the, just listen. Do you hear that? I hope this isn't too annoying. So our chimney goes like up, you know, to the roof. So if it rains or if it's really windy, you can really hear that coming through our fireplace. So hopefully that isn't too annoying, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you. I haven't, I don't know. I don't feel like I've bought a lot of stuff, but I do often, I like to buy new clothes. I like to freshen up my wardrobe every time seasons change. My sizing changes a little bit and I need to buy new clothes for my body. I like to, when I can, get sales at the end of the season. So I'm gonna start by showing you some items that I got at the end of last summer that were on for a really good sale that I haven't worn yet. But as the weather warms up, hopefully I will be wearing these clothes soon. So I'm gonna go ahead and first, okay, these first three items I'm gonna show you, these are from a store here in Canada. I think it's just a Canadian store called Ricky's. They had a great sale on some shirts end of last summer. And so I think these ones were $4.99. They might have even been $4.99 with an extra 25% off. I don't know, they were really cheap. And so this is just a simple Henley tank. I like this like textured look. It's not just a solid color. This other shirt I got is very similar to that. And as I'm pulling it out, I'm like, this is very, very similar to the shirt I'm currently wearing with the button up and the V-neck. Let me set my camera back up. Uh, this one. <laughs> It's pretty similar, it's a V-neck, button up. Um, it's just a little bit of a, a lighter color. So that one again was like that $4.99. And then I got a pair of pants that are a little bit different than what I typically wear. And they are perfect for the springtime though. They are a very wide leg, cropped. I think they might be a linen. Uh, and these have like the really wide legs. What are these called? There's a name for these pants. It starts with a P, it has a double S in it. Uh, the name is not coming to me right now, but the name of these wide leg pants. Okay, so those are the items I got at the end of last summer. I think that's about it that I bought at the end of last summer. And then for this summer, the first dress I'm gonna show you is my Easter Sunday dress. I love that pattern i searched high and low i will definitely do a try on for this one as i know it's hard to see as i'm just showing you you know on this little screen but i searched high and low for a nice easter dress i finally found this one at winners i also wanted to buy just a couple more dresses for myself especially casual dresses i just i love wearing dresses in the summertime so i found this one this is a pricier item. This is a Columbia dress, so it's really good quality. It's a super light, super light material. I was just looking at it this morning because I thought I'm going to want to say what the material is when I'm filming my video and I'm not good at knowing materials. It is mostly made of nylon, so it's a really, really light material. I love Sometimes I feel like, okay, I just wanna buy a few new items of clothing and maybe they are cheap items and sometimes that's fine. Other items I wanna buy better quality and I love when I can buy a dress like this one. So, so thin, but I don't need anything under it, like undergarments of course, but I don't need like a tank or a slip or anything, it's not see-through. Uh, I just, I love that about spending a little bit more on dresses. Then I bought this dress. I really like the pattern on this. It looks really nice and summery. It just has the spaghetti strap top, but I love how it still has a really nice high neckline. I do need to buy 
a strapless bra to go with this because I don't have one and I'm gonna want that when I'm wearing this dress. But I love how modest it is, even though it has just the thin straps. It is a knee length dress. It has just an optional uh, tie on for the waist. And then one more dress I got, one more? Yeah, this is the last dress I bought. This one is from Laura. That is a dress store here. And um, their dresses, again, very good quality. This dress, new, I think probably would have been like 120 or something, but I got it on sale for 45. I love the detail on the neck here in the back. Again, you can't really see it as I'm holding it, but it has a crisscross back, just a nice knee length. Again, it feels pretty thin. It's gonna be nice and light for the summer, but I don't need to wear any anything extra underneath it. So I love that. I like getting a lot of my shorts and pants from Old Navy, and so I just got a pair of black shorts. I like to buy, what are these? These are the seven inch shorts. So they're not quite as long as the Bermuda shorts, but they're not, they're not short either. I did need a few new athletic pieces. I do work out regularly, and so I like to just once in a while update my, my workout wardrobe and so I love the Under Armour brand most of my stuff is from Under Armour and so I got these shorts uh, these are just a little bit longer they're not just the tiny little shorts and they're fairly loose so they don't like bunch up as I'm you know doing a hit workout or anything so these are just really nice comfy I love love the Under Armour brand I also got a new pair of Under Armour leggings they must be in the laundry because I couldn't find them this morning. I think I wore them yesterday for my workout. So that's why I don't have those. So I didn't, I didn't need a lot going into the summer. I did want a few new pieces, but one thing I needed was new swimsuits. And so I bought two. I had two for the past few years. It's been a few years since I bought a new one. And so I just needed two new swimsuits. My other two swimsuits, too small. Time to pass those on. And we do go to the beach quite a lot. So swimsuits are one of those things that I do wanna spend the extra money on because I wanna get good quality. I'm also pretty picky about fit and uh, style of swimsuits. So I got this one. This one has removable straps on it. I don't know how well you're gonna see this and I know you'd see it better if I tried it on, but I'm not gonna do a try on of my swimsuits. Maybe I will just like, I don't know, lay it out so you can see it a little bit better. But it is just a simple one piece, but it has this like loose bit in the back that just flows, hides anything like around your bum and hips. It just kind of covers that, gives a little bit more modesty. I, I've worn this one one time, Andrew and I went to the spa and I wore this swimsuit and I was really, really happy with it. And then my other swimsuit, my second one, I got from, these are both from Nike. So I got just this pair of shorts. I love the shorts that have the, like the, the swimsuit bottom underneath. And so you can just wear that alone, a standalone bottom. And then I got this Nike top as well fitted at the top, a little bit flowier around the waist, and I really like the detail at the back of that one as well. So I did spend a bit, I think the one piece swimsuit was 50, way on sale, it was 50, and then this was probably like 120 for this two piece, but like I said, we go to the beach about weekly all summer, and I think I do wanna get one more swimsuit. I would love to have three swimsuits to choose from instead of just two, but these will be my swimsuits for the next several years. So I like to go for quality with my swimsuits. So I think that's all that I wanted to show you. I'm sure I'll buy a couple more things as we go throughout the summer. I think I haven't bought any new shoes recently. I did buy a pair of sandals. Maybe I should pull those out and show you too. I bought one new pair of sandals at the end of last summer that I didn't get to wear. So I'll wear those this summer. I always like to try to get those deals. It's always hard. Like even now as we're, you know, getting into warmer weather and winter clothes are way on sale, but I have to like, okay, do I want to? I know these are great deals, but like I am just so into, I want to get new spring clothes. So I like to buy just a couple of, you know, clearance and good sale items and then also shop for, for the coming season. Cause that's a lot more fun, especially as it's summer. I think, uh, I love to buy summer clothes. So that is all. I'm gonna turn this off 
and then do a little try on for you guys. I am sitting in this space which looks very clean uh, from what you guys can see, but there's a whole bunch of stuff. Like this side of my room is a mess, renovation stuff, kind of up here too. So hopefully I can film a try on and still make it look like my room is pretty clean. Thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed seeing a clothing haul for me for a change instead of just a clothing haul for my kids. Subscribe to my channel if you are new here and you want to see more of my content and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.